Welcome back everybody. Latest conditions in the capital city under a mostly fair sky. Temperatures have dropped down a couple degrees to 58 degrees. It's not too bad out the normal high average high this time of year middle 50. So running above average for this time of year and those gusty winds have been part of the reason why and they're out of the south too. 17 mile per hour winds still at this hour gusting to 23. We've had gusts approach 40 miles per hour today and we expected that we had told you about this yesterday that the winds are going to be very gusty today and the dew points have been very very low. We've had critical fire danger today. Again, no open burning now that we're going into the sunset hours, the evening hours, I should say. It looks like the winds will start to slow down around here. It's 53. The winds are a little slower in Columbia. South breeze at 14. Dew points are down into the 20s there too. Pressure is holding steady. There's a storm gathering strength to our west. It'll take a couple days to get here. We've got some cloud cover. I should say 24 hours for that storm to get here. We've got some cloud cover on top of us now. Clouds stretching back from St. Joe back into Kansas. We'll see more clouds mix in from time to time. But we're rain free still here on the radar. We do believe that this is going to change heading into tomorrow evening. We'll have some light showers possible starting, let's say, midday tomorrow. But the best rain chances will be tomorrow evening as a cold front pushes in from the north and west. Temps in the 50s here. Mid-Missouri, we've got some 50s as well all across the state for the most part, though a little cooler off to our south and east. Look at Poplar Bluff just at 48. And look at these strong southerly winds still sustained between 10 and 20 miles per hour across the entire state. And we've had some gusts in the last hour or so up near 30 miles per hour. Again, the winds will slow down here as we get into the evening hours now that we've lost the heat from the sunlight from today. Temperatures 50s here, 40s to our east. Look at these warm numbers, 60s to our west. We're going to see some of those figures in our area heading into tomorrow. There's the cloud cover stretching back into Colorado, and our storm is off to our north and northwest. We go to our satellite radar showing, yeah, we've got the front hanging tough nearby. It'll be here late tomorrow. Temperatures will be in the 40s for the evening hours. Still some gusty winds. Clouds will thicken up into tomorrow morning. Lows only in the 40s. Highs tomorrow in the 60s with a mix of sun and clouds. Some showers will pop up tomorrow evening. Very isolated in nature. We could even see a shower into the early part of your Sunday, maybe even into Sunday evening. Temperatures much colder on Sunday. Highs only into the 40s. 43 tonight, Columbia. 44 in the capital. 43 Lake of the Ozarks. 67 tomorrow in the capital. 66 Columbia. 67 at the lake. Mostly cloudy skies and there's a slight chance of a shower after the midday hours starting tomorrow into tomorrow night and early Sunday. And look at the temperature drop 67 tomorrow, but 47 on Sunday. Mostly cloudy back into the 50s Monday. We could see some showers on Monday. I'm not optimistic about rain chances for Monday, so most of the day will probably end up being dry. But Tuesday we'll have some widespread showers and thunderstorms across the area. Temperatures will be in the low 50s. Another Cold front sweeps through, but temperatures actually go up. Go figure for Wednesday and look at Thursday and Friday. You almost can't ask for better weather on Thanksgiving. Maybe a little too warm. I know some of the hunters have been worried about, mm -hmm. you know, the deer hunters worry about how warm the temperatures have been. And we've had windy conditions that are just not ideal for hunting, no. but you know, it's the, the it's the hand we've been dealt by Mother yep. Nature. And most the extra season in January, although it's not as much fun to hunt in January. No, that's for sure. A little bit warmer this time. Mild weather for Black Friday. Yes. Be nice. mm -hmm. Well, still.